Hey Team Creative, welcome back guys. Today we are going to be doing something a little different. I decided I wanted to do something for Valentine's Day. I'm doing this on a budget because it is a Valentine's Day. Simple install. Um, I got all of my products from the Dollar Tree. They were about, it was under $20. Um, I'm going to show you the balloons. I'm just using standard 12 inch balloons. I'm going to size them down to 6 inch with my balloon sizer. So I'm going to show you the clusters that I've already blown up as well as a little sign that I got. Um, I think I'm going to make a heart shape um, balloon piece. I'm going to see how this turns out. This is the first time I've done this. So if you're interested in seeing how this works, guys, um, please stay tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This is a great piece for um, a kid's party at their school, um, something romantic if you're setting something up at home, just any type of Valentine's Day um, celebration. So let's jump right into the video and I'm going to give you guys a clip of the products that I'm using from the Dollar Tree. Okay guys, so as you see here, I've blown up quads in three colors, white, red, and pink. And I did get these balloons um, from the Dollar Tree. There are the packs from the Dollar Tree. I have a sign there. I have some 260 balloons, a pair of scissors. I also have some fishing line. And then I have my handy dandy balloon sizer. So I just want to give you guys a clip. Um, I have not counted. I think I had four pack of pink, four pack of red, and two packs of white. Um, I did them all six inches except for the last four quads. I went down to about four inches to try to pull the heart together. I'm hoping that works. But I will definitely drop in the comment section below exactly how many quads I use as well as the different packs and colors. So we're going to jump right into this and I will show you guys um, how I'm going to connect these using fishing line. Alright guys, so I went ahead and strung my first section. I decided to use um, balloon string. I decided to use balloon string rather than using um, fishing line. But fishing line would make it easier not to show. But I wanted to use everything from the Dollar Tree since this is kind of a Dollar Tree video. So balloon string, pink. <clears throat> you just have to be careful when you pull it through. I do have a spot that I can see where mine is showing a little bit. But you can cover that up with other balloons or clip it. You just have to be careful. So here I'm just tying three times a knot onto my quad so that I can get ready to start <clears throat> connecting my balloons, guys. And I had to go throw some pants on because I don't know why I put on a dress to move around in this, but I'm home relaxing, so here we go. So I'm going to take my first quad, put it on top. My balloon string go around, down, and back under, almost to make like a figure eight. And I'm gonna try to keep these tight because it should make it easier. My other got a little loose when I did it. I went on ahead and did the other side. I did two of these for each side. So I did figure out, guys, I'm using. down around and under to try to make sure it stays tight and secure and well set so I'm using seven red quads eight pink quads and four white quads and my last white one went down to like a four inch these are about six inch I use my size so trying to keep it nice and tight so they don't shift too much to keep them stacked as they grow.
And I'm just going to use the strings that I have to connect the two points at the bottom. Okay, Team Creative. So this was not the easiest project as far as putting it up because I am by myself. Didn't want to mount it to the walls. If you mount it to the walls with a command hook or some over the door hooks, it would be much easier to manipulate. You can add three inch, four inch balloons to make it more organic. Um, I just installed it on a mirror with a suction cup. Sorry, the reflection is just not gonna let you guys see that. But there's a suction cup because I'm gonna take it back down. It's strictly for the purpose of the video, but I think it came out pretty cute. Um, you definitely could shape it more. Like I said, if you put it up where it's a little more sturdy because it is flimsy and you have to kind of be able to maneuver it. But I did this entirely by myself. No help to hang it. So I think it came out pretty good, guys. Drop me in the comment section below if you have an easier way to do a balloon heart um, install or any type of balloon decor for Valentine's Day. I love hearing from you guys. Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Love you guys. See you in the next video.